What is up, y'all? Hope y'all having a wonderful day. We are here at the Azalea Course at Lakewood Golf Club here in Point Clear, Alabama, staying at the Grand Hotel and Resort. This place is awesome. Wanted to take a little breather from the matches, and we're going to do a little scramble here on the front nine at Azalea. There are no pins out there, however, on the course. <laughs> we're allowed to be out here playing. However, there's no pin set. We're the only ones on this course. So we figured we'd just do a little scramble, see how low we can go with no pins, having no idea where the pin is on the green. Ready for a little scramble, sir? This is gonna be fun. This is a dream scenario. I get to scramble with Zach Rafford. Let's go, <laughs> even though I think I'm gonna be carrying you on this nine. So this being a scramble, I really have no idea how aggressive we wanna be, but it does bend around to the right, like back in there somewhere. It's Going with the driver, driver here. That's left. Okay. It's in play. It I is in play. play. I really wanted to put the thumbs up right there because I hit that exactly how I wanted to and hit it pretty hard. However, I don't know how far it is to clear that corner. I'm going to give it the thumbs up but I don't know where it ended up. <laughs> so we can officially put the thumbs up. That is absolutely perfect. Right here, middle of the fairway, probably even could have hit it further right. Actually, definitely could have hit it further right because we are kind of left center. No idea how far it is exactly, but we're guesstimating somewhere between 270 and like 280. Three wood, I don't have a three wood. He's gonna let me borrow this three wood. Hey, look good, feel good, play good. Let's hit well. Short. Right, just little short. Little deal, but I liked it. Uh oh, I think he may be turning to pee. Both up there short of the green. We'll go find it, hit it again. The only stipulation we're giving ourselves is when we get inside of 50 yards, we're able to go see where the hole is. Hole is right in the middle of the green, and both of us here are about 40 yards just short of the green. Right there, pretty much in the center of the frame, is where the hole is, just above that ridge. Go. That was right at it. Okay, you got me by about two feet. <laughs> Well, wanted to keep you company. I like it, Zach. Let's go. Dude, let's Come on, go. baby. Where's our pin? <laughs> I was looking there for it. There we go. Dude, that's what I like to see. Rolling the rock early. Yeah. One under through one. We Absolutely. got eight holes left. See if we can't birdie every hole. Mm -hmm. We're on number two here, par four. Pretty straight, bends a little to the right. And take a lesson, when you're playing a scramble, don't try to swing out of your shoes. All right, hang on pods. Did miss it a little right, but decent distance into the wind. We've got 115 to the back edge of the green, so probably 100 to the center. Into the win, I'm gonna go with the 54. What do you think we're gonna shoot for this nine holes? We've already had one birdie. That's full. It's a little left, kind of left edge of the green. He is putting up. Hopefully the pin's on the front. You got the front, I'll hit one towards the back. Okay, all right. I like it. Okay. This is a crazy green. It is massive. I am pretty much right in the middle of the green, level with the hole. We've got about 30 feet putting across the green here, but I needed to hit that way further right. I hammered it, Zach. Settled. That's gonna hit the camera. We don't need to make a bogey on a scramble. We do not.
Oh, go in, baby. Oh! oh. Dude, that looked so good for so long. All right, and it went far. Sometimes playing courses with no pins is kind of fun, and it also teaches you just to hit it at the middle of the green. Because if you're hitting every shot middle of the green, you're gonna make a lot of pars. If you ever get the opportunity, go out there, play, even if there are pins, play every shot, approach shot, to the middle of the green. Just see what you score. Because a lot of times you're going after pins you shouldn't be, and making a lot of bogeys that you wouldn't if you just hit it at the middle of the green. One under, we're on number three, par four. Bends a little to the right, 425 yards, and this time, sir, maybe don't swing out of your shoes. Yeah, don't do that. Just put it in the fairway. Good ball. Hole cut, but it'll hey. work. I think that was pretty good. <laughs> Woo! This new shaft, the hazardous Hulk smoke, this thing's pretty. All right, in good shape right here. 101 yards left to the center of the green. Give me a task and I'll do it. Okay, hit it over that bunker. Okay, comfy little 330 drive right here though, Zach. I did hit that one well. I was really happy with that swing. That driver's feeling pretty good. So he went right in the middle of the green. That was a little chunky. So unfortunately, mine is the better option. I did have the right idea on direction. This pin is kind of up front here on the right side. It's got to sit. That is awful. Go in. Oh! Pushed it. Nice solo par. Well, the birdie barrage hasn't quite happened yet. We're one under through three holes. We don't need to miss another green with wedge in hand. We're on to number four, par three. From right here to the middle of the green is 168 yards. So maybe one of us kind of hit left center of the green and the other one right center of the green. I'm going to be going with an eight iron. One's kind of hurting off the left. I'm going to butter a seven. Thin to win. Thin to win. Sit. All right. Kind of back edge. Yeah. Just right off the back. Drifting a little right, but hit solid. I'm in this bottom bowl area, and unfortunately, so far, not seeing the pin. There it is, all the way back here. Harris had to have come pretty close. Here's where his ball landed. Yeah. It just trundled Super through tight. the green. That's just a long putt. That is a very long putt. Basically, we just need to get it up and over the edge, and it should trundle all the way down to the hole. I think we're going to have to play it up in here, and it's going to come down sideways. I mean, it's almost too much getting it this high. Ooh. Dude, that was a lot better than mine. I went too high. All right, that one's far. All right, through four holes, haven't quite made as many birdies as we were hoping for. However, here, number five, 355 par four. If we can get it inside of 50 yards, we can go up there and look to see where the hole is. That is a huge advantage. Dude, I let it fly, sir. This is a scramble. I didn't come here to lay up. If we can pound that driver 330 with the wind, be pin high. What do you think? I like it. I like it, too. He hit it good. Go ball. 
Couldn't tell. I can't tell either. Just like that. I love it, bro. So good. So my ball didn't quite carry to the fairway, but we did find it. We're in the hazard, and here's the hole. Very front edge. We've got 41 yards, so according to our rule, we are able to come up here and see where the pin is. This is not an easy shot. And that is straight over my head. Right there. Oh, Flopadopolis. Settle, settle. And it's going around me. And we got about 30 footer. So in hindsight, if we would have known the pin was up close, we wouldn't have both hit driver there because you do not want to be 30, 40 yards short of this green to that pin. Only if the pin was back here, maybe. Go! 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 Oh hey, that my was a God. Line. Come on. Keep walking off the green thinking I should be putting the flag in. And I'm like, no, there's no flags out here. All right, through five holes or one under, we definitely want to get some more birdies here. We've got four holes remaining, see if we can do it. We're skipping to hole 15. This was like one of the old nines. So we played one, two, three, four, five on Azalea. Now we're gonna play 15, 16, 17, 18 in for the nine holes. This was like the old nine. Hopefully get to all the holes while we're out here but just kind of wanted to play this kind of original loop. Have 185 yards to the middle of the green from where we're hitting from this back box, right back into the wind. I'm actually probably gonna hit a six iron here. And I'm hitting a five because I can't really feel my hands. Just drawing just a little bit. Sit. Club twirl. I don't think it needs to sit. That's in the middle of the green. Good Best swing. Best shot I've hit all day. Covered it well. We got yours up on the green. <laughs> That's a little short right there. I didn't make a good swing. And if I would have, I was pretty much right in line, just way short. Harris hit kind of middle of the green, trundled a little to the left. And the pin is all the way on the right side. Do you want to chip yours? You think it's easier? Yeah, I kind of do. So Zach forgot my putter. <laughs> it's only about 30 yards away, but I did forget it. So. I don't even know how. I, I don't even know how to putt with a center shafted putter. What are you supposed to do? It Take just, it back outside and in, like you, and swipe it? Wow! Wow! That was a low blow. Low blow. <laughs> or reset. <laughs> oh. Well, there's one. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. See how we do it. There we go. Dude, the reset works for him. Maybe I should start doing that, Scott. <laughs> wow. I don't know what to say, but I saw more there. All right, he's still one under That's through right, six. Man. <laughs> At this rate, I just hope we stay under par. 479-yard par four. Looks to play straight away. I don't know if those bunkers are reachable or carryable, so we're just going to hopefully split them right down the middle. On the right side, kind of towards the right bunker, maybe right edge of the bunker. All right, just in the rough over there. It's pretty good. Power fade. All right. Kind of in the same direction. Both missed those a little right. All right, so we've got 143. Actually, a great look at the green from here. And how about that? Y'all see that flag just 
I'm not really whipping in the wind right now, but it is up there. I've never been so excited to see a flag <laughs> in my life. I agree. So now we can pin slam it if we can put one on the green. What club are you going with? I got a U wedge, so it's like a 50, 51 degree. That was hit good. Pretty much right at it. Go in. That is what we needed, sir. There we go. That is what we needed. Just right at the flag. Good swing. That's looking real nice. Okay. We got options up there. Those are probably two of our better swings today. So we got a birdie look. I like having options. How about that shot in there? Harris is fixing his divot. He played the flyer, landed firm like he thought downwind. He's in here about four or five feet, and I am just a little longer, about 12 feet there. That's what we were looking for. Hopefully this can get us back on track to finish strong. I wanted to mention real quick how good these greens are out here so at good. both courses. These things are pure. This is middle of winter as well. So super impressed with the ground screw out here. This course for being January is in tremendous shape. Fairways are good. Let's go. Go baby. Pin slammers here on the channel today. An actual pin slammer. Let's go. Well, these lengthy par fours don't let up. No, they don't. This is our eighth hole, number 17 out here at the Azalea course. Really good looking hole here, 476. Wow. Yeah. Well, no other option to you how to let it fly. Wind's not helping here. It's gonna be coming off the right. There it is. That's right down central. Okay. Good swing. That was a nice one, Zach. Dude, I'm telling you, this is, I know in one of our matches, if you watch the other two matches, I had some drives that weren't great, but I'm really getting this shaft down and I'm hitting it well, I'm loving it. Right here, good shape, still a long ways home and we can't really tell where the green is. We think it's like in that direction. So they teased us to have one flag out here. <laughs> yeah, we need one on this hole right here. 185, kind of into the quartering mm -hmm. wind. I'm probably gonna hit five iron because it's getting cold. That thick tree is like just off the left edge of the green. So okay, so maybe. somewhere like right in there. Oh, it's heading it's left. I think that was gonna be pretty good distance. Looks good. I hit it right where I was looking. Harris was just a little left of the green and I sent that right over the top of the hole. It is right there, we're about 20 feet. Got a decent look for a birdie. I'm gonna fix that pitch mark here in a second, but that's where it landed to the hole. That was the line. That was the line, just a little less pace, but we're in with the par. Two under through eight, one hole remaining. Just want to quickly talk about these closing holes here. These last three holes are brutally tough par fours. 18 here, our ninth and final hole is 440 yards crosswind. So these last three holes are all you want for a finishing stretch. Pretty much straight away, to high low fly. Going at that tree there, just left of the cart. A little baby fade. That was, that was fade. It's straight. All right, probably just in the rough. Towards the trees. 
I've got to say, these trees out here are pretty sweet. Really liking the vegetation. I do too, man. Just makes you happy when you're out here playing a course that looks good. We got 175. 175. Well, to the best of my knowledge, shooting <laughs> uh, the lighter color grass up there. To the center of the green. This is what we're looking at. Into the wind. I mean, I know it's calling my name. The low punch stinger. I'm going to open my uh, five iron or four iron. I'm going to open the face and cut it high and kind of around the tree. Okay. Hey, <laughs> I got my popcorn ready. <laughs> yeah. It's trundling. <laughs> I love it. Dude, dude, it's on the green. <laughs> I know, bro. Dude, let's go. Let's go. My ball is pretty much right in the middle of the green, and we still don't see the hole. Here it is. It is all the way up front here. Okay, okay. So, not front. bad but right up there. I was pretty pumped about that. That was so pure. I'm glad because we're a lot better <laughs> shape than I was trying to go a high cut four iron over the tree at 175. I think we might be the only ones still out here on the course. Because we're crazy. Yes. I like it a lot. <laughs> I really don't. That was a really Really early call. Oh, dude, it just broke off the face of the earth. That definitely broke more than we thought. <laughs> Easy. Wow. Good round, sir. Thank you, sir. Enjoyed it. Yeah. Enjoyed it. Absolutely, every time. Sorry there weren't really all that many fireworks finish it two under, but hope you all enjoyed this video. We enjoyed it out here in the cold and the last people on the course. So as for me, Harris, see you when we see you. Peace.